we've heard Max Crosby is a little banged up. How has he? I mean, he's he's a Miles Garrett type. Is you know, fans here will compare him, and and he's in in a comparison with the elite in the league. How has he been um, with that banged up leg? Yeah, and uh, you know, he was. Yeah, I began. Antonio Pierce used the term eighty percent of Max Crosby is better than most most players, and he definitely, you know, uh, um, you know, showed up on on, on Sunday and, and played through it. But it was obvious that he wasn't healthy. He hasn't practiced yet this week, and uh, we just got off the field here on uh, Thursday, and uh, and he wasn't on on the practice field. So, uh, what that means for his status on Sunday, it's I don't remember too often covering this team where where Max Crosby wasn't out on the practice field in some form whether it was limited or or full and he just hasn't even been able to make it out to the practice field say all, saying all that you know he's kind of a disciple of a kobe bryant and kobe bryant was notorious for playing through injuries and max has been notorious for playing through injuries uh he played through two situations last year that literally required off-season surgeries two different not one but two different uh injuries that he was dealing with last year that required surgery afterwards so uh, my money would be him be on him playing on Sunday, um, but to what extent and to what level that remains to be seen because it is a high ankle sprain, uh, and I get I'm leaving a little bit of room open for the possibility that he just doesn't play uh, and the Raiders try to survive this week and buy some time in order to get Max Crosby as healthy as possible because there's no question that that defense. Uh, needs Max Crosby, uh, the, the, the high-end Max Crosby, uh, for that defense to be successful. And and, and maybe you, you, you cut a corner in one game in order to make that happen for more games down the road. Uh, but at the same time, uh, they really can't afford to go down one and three. You know, two and two, I think that they would, if you were talking about where would the Raiders want to be, uh, aside from being 4-0, and oh, obviously, uh, two and two, I think they would have taken, given this schedule. Uh, to start the season. So that's still possible for them and still out in front. And by the way, we we're just looking at the numbers today, and I know this sounds silly, but if the season were to end today, as bad as it's been for the Raiders, they'd be in the playoffs right now. <laughs> that's because nobody in, there's a lot of trouble spots in the, in the AFC right now. You figure some teams are going to get it straightened out, but at the same time, it kind of tells you that not definitely not time to panic, but falling into a one and three hole, boy, I'll tell you what, uh, that would be kind of dire straits for the Raiders. 